Hi, welcome back to EduHub Academia, the education for a better future platform. We will resume the physics course, the world of physics, with lecture number 17, solid state physics. Solid state physics unlocks the secrets of the solid world around us. It's the study of rigid matter or solids through methods such as solid state chemistry, quantum mechanics, crystallography, electromagnetism, and metallurgy. It's the largest branch of condensed matter physics. In solid state physics, scientists investigate how atoms are arranged and bonded in solids that will lead to a wide range of physical properties. These properties can be broadly categorized as electrical, thermal, and optical. Starting with the first one, which is the electrical, the electrical behavior of solids is a cornerstone of modern electronics. Semiconductors like the silicon have a unique conductivity that can be controlled by doping, making them the building blocks of transistors. Transistors act as tiny switches and amplifier, forming the heart of integrated circuits that power our computers and smartphones and many, many, many other electronic devices. Superconductors, on the other hand, exhibit a remarkable property. They offer zero electrical resistance at incredibly low temperatures. This will allow the electric current to flow, a perfect flow of electricity, with no energy loss, holding immense great potential for applications like power transmission and magnetic levitation trains. The second property is the thermal. Thermal conductivity determines a material's ability to conduct heat. Metals, for instance, are excellent heat conductors while ceramics are good insulators. Understanding these properties is essential in designing heat sinks for electronics or thermal insulation for buildings. The last the third and the last property of solid state physics is the optical. Some solids are transparent, which means they allow light to go through them. Others are opaque, they block light. This behavior is determined by the interaction of light with the atomic structure of the material. Taking solar cells, for example, like the ones you see in this picture, they rely on the ability of certain solids to absorb light and convert it into electricity. Now, solid state physics is a powerful tool for engineering new materials with custom made properties. By understanding the fundamental principles governing the behavior of solids, scientists can develop innovative materials for electronics, energy storage, and a variety of other applications. So, the next time you see your phone or witness a towering skyscraper. Remember the fascinating world of solid state physics that underpins these everyday wonders. Thank you much for listening. Looking forward to meeting you next time.